AI is changing healthcare faster than ever. From diagnosing diseases to assisting in surgeries, AI is actually making waves in the medical world. Is it actually revolutionary or is it just another overhyped trend? Hello everyone, I am your host for today, Mars from Arthunik AI. And in this video, we're going to be diving into how AI is transforming healthcare. If it's working, if it's not working, and if doctors should be worried about being replaced. Make sure you stick around to the end because I'll also share some mind-blowing AI tools that are already being used in healthcare and are actually saving a lot of lives. And trust me, some of them will shock you. AI's role in healthcare. Healthcare has always been about expertise, experience, and even human intuition. But now, AI is stepping in with the data-driven physicians. Here's where it's making the biggest impact. Number one, AI for diagnosis and disease detection. AI analyzes medical images, detects diseases early, and reduces human error. For example, Google's DeepMind AI actually performed better than many doctors in diagnosing an eye disease. Number two, AI in surgery. Robotic assisted surgery makes procedure more precise and less invasive. For example, the Da Vinci surgical system has assisted in thousands of surgeries worldwide. Number three, AI chatbots and virtual health assistants. AI driven chatbots provide 24 7 supervision and triage patients. For example, ADA and Babylon Health. They help in diagnosing diseases in seconds. Number four, AI in drug discovery and development. Now, AI actually speeds up drug discovery, cutting costs and development time. Many people don't know this, but you might find this really interesting. Like, as you may know, we were all hit with COVID 19 back in 2020, and AI actually helped develop the COVID 19 vaccine in record speed. Number five, AI for personalized treatment. AI analyzes patient data to come up with custom treatments and medication plans. For example, IBM Watson Health helps oncologists to find the best cancer treatments. Deep dive, AI in action. But how does this look in real life? Let's break it down. Imagine walking into a clinic, but instead of waiting for hours for doctors to be free, AI actually scans your entire body and tells you what's wrong with you in the matter of minutes. Sounds like a sci-fi movie, right? Well, it's already happening. Doctors are also taking the help of AI to detect cancer, which many of the specialists are also missing. If there is one thing that everyone should keep in mind is that AI is not replacing human expertise. It's actually enhancing them. So what about surgeries? Have you thought about it? AI powered robotic arm can actually perform procedures with superhuman precision. It's like no shaky hands here, just flawless execution, which is according to me exactly what humans need. Now getting to the point where people are actually afraid, humans versus AI, and if doctors should I actually be worried. Okay, so it's time to get real. Yeah, AI is powerful, but will it replace humans? Let's make a list where AI wins and where humans win. Processing massive amounts of data in seconds. Emotional intelligence and patient care. Reducing human error in diagnosis. Ethical decision making in complex cases. Handling routine tasks like medical record analysis and triage. And of course, something AI does not have, human intuition and experience-based judgment. The truth, AI is an assistant, not a replacement. See, the best results happen when AI and the doctors work together. AI doesn't have empathy, but doctors do. Humans don't have superhuman precision, but AI does. See, this is best of both worlds. But yeah, AI doesn't comfort you just before you're going to surgery or having a major procedure. Humans do that. AI is a tool, not a miracle worker. Keeping that in mind, we're going to the next topic, which is the future of AI in healthcare. What's next for AI? Honestly, if you think AI is impressive now, wait till you see what's coming next. Here are some of the things that we have to look forward to in AI's future in healthcare. Number one is AI-powered predictive medicine. It sounds kind of insane, but it's actually true that AI will predict the disease way before even the symptoms show. Number two, AI-driven prosthetics and implants. It will be like AI-powered limbs that will adapt to the user, not the other way around. Number three, AI in mental health. AI tools that will detect depression or anxiety via voice patterns and facial expressions. Number four, AI for remote surgery. Like surgeons operating on patients, but from thousands of miles away. AI isn't just a tool. It is shaping the future of medicine. The hospitals of tomorrow will be powered by AI. And maybe, just maybe, we trust them as much as we trust our doctors today. Okay, to boil it down, let's just get right into it. If we should really trust AI in healthcare. Like I said, AI isn't replacing doctors. It is empowering them. Hospitals that adapt AI will provide better, faster, and even affordable care. 
But the real question is, are we ready to trust AI in our healthcare? What's your take on this? Should AI have more control in medicine or should we just leave it to the doctors? Drop your thoughts in the comments. I'll be sure to check them out. If you found this video insightful or to be interesting, then make sure you like this video and subscribe if you're new. This is Mars from Adhunik AI signing off.